Wait, there's still this. There's still this. Good morning, welcome to Mine O'Clock here on Loading Ready Run Twitch.tv. Wait, I did it wrong again. Holy moly, carrot, carrot, milk, carrot, milk, carrot, milk. Emdrift, thank you so much for <laughs> creating what is just the most absurd thing uh, that I've ever heard. I love it. I'm so happy it exists. And you better believe that we're gonna, we're gonna, we're just gonna listen to that every time, every day. Every day! I mean, every day we stream Minecraft, which is every t Tuesday. So every Tuesday! Oh, there you go. Full version of Night Vision Coffee, now available over on M Drift's SoundCloud. So go forth. Get it. Put it on your, uh, put it on your Zoom. Listen it, listen to it while you power walk, which I assume, uh, is what everybody does. They listen to music on their, their Zoom while they power walk. <laughs> uh, hey, really quick here. Uh, Venara, 71 months. TXC2, 60 months. Wow, how did I make it to five years? Random shoes for 11 months. Mars is dead, 26 months. I love that the stream is later now. I get to watch live. Still my favorite lure stream. R Crads, 26 months. Polaris, 415 for 20 months. Carrot, carrot, milk. Optimistic Nihilist for 24 months. Two years. Exactly is intended. 28 months is two years. Plus some extra months. Cool hand to 69. Nice. Can I get a dab now, James? Hey, look at that. I dabbed without even reading. I'm we're like mind meld. Cool hand to wait, got that one. Steve Stein, 22 months, smashing that reset for finally putting Surge in the intro. I raised my tall glass of carrot carrot milk to you, sir. Hashtag and surge. And Richards for 77 months says milk milk carrot. Wait. Yeah, you did that wrong. That's fine. Uh where are my friends? Friends? Hello? Hey. hey! There you are. How's it going? Sir, I can't hear you over this banger. Yeah. Isn't it a banger? Such a banger. <laughs> Wait. What? I just realized. I can't hear you. I didn't turn on these lights. Hi. Uh, all right. Hey, everybody. We're here. We're, we're ready to play some Minecraft. Ooh, yeah. Serge, you have a new magic ring? I I do have a new magic ring. Right, it's oh, called yeah. an assembly halo. An assembly halo. Yeah, it's kind of a big deal. Hold on. Sorry about that. Yeah, it's um it's weird. It follows me around. It's magical. It's it's kind of like a really cool pet, actually. I mean it's it's basically a glorified uh, crafting table on a stick. Oh, Wait. I should probably throw it in lava then. Thanks, Duno. All right, I'm just yeah, I'm just, I'm just gonna save you from that now. Oh, gross. Gunpowder. Oh, what a useless mod. Ah. Oh. All right, we're all good. Lintune, 44 months. Welcome back. Where is home? Here it is. <laughs> Minecraft snow. It's. I guess it's pretty pretty bad for the uh the stream the stream which is why we're gonna go to sleep and hopefully make it go away um all right so what so what, so it's a glorified crafting table yeah okay i'll uh, i'll uh, hook you up i'm just grabbing some carrots and i'll be on my way where did we set up this string farm again oh it's right here it's in the um nice the farming loo the Botanaloo? Uh, we need a uh, we need a name. It's just outside of it. This is perfect. Yeah, there's a couple of cloches just nearby. Yeah. This what is... do you mean nearby, not inside? Well, there's the problem of not being able to get power all the way over there at the minute. Is this another Uno complete project? Yes. Yes. Yeah, it's done. <laughs> it can it can be torn down. It's fine. Kill it. 
I'm gonna... I mean, if you have to. Well, we have enough string now. Yeah, there you go. I think so. This is project number one, complete operation string on roof. So project number two, um, I don't know which one of you wants to do this, but we need to actually put a door on the gigaloo. Like it doesn't, it doesn't have the the little entrance thingy that the other loos have. Igloos have. I can I can start doing that. Um... Heck yeah. Yeah, I'll start doing that. I'll um, try and extend the uh, design. And then I I'm gonna work on the um, floor pattern on the inside. Do we want to do another mine session? Are we feeling pretty good in regards to resources? Eh, I think we're fine right now. How's it going, by the way? How's your week been? Who, my week? Yeah. But not, oh, not wow. Who yeah, knows? this is... Wow, yeah, rude. This is uh, <laughs> certainly just outside here. <laughs> I told you. Look, Serge, not everything can be pretty. Sometimes it's just got to be functional. It's just got to be there, and you've got to you've got to have it. But what's the point? Uh, oh God! Makes drink. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, I just realized I did not turn my music on. I was like, why is it so quiet? I mean, we could we could run run some big cables across to get power into the different loops. Right now, the goal is. I, I think right now the the plan is just let's I think we can basically move everything into the gigaloo So we're gonna see what that looks like So if we move everything into the gigaloo Should we then turn the various igloos into like personal homes? What do you want to do with that? Yeah, we could probably do something like that Yeah uh, All right, let's keep going with the string Just grabbing a few things uh oh, is there some string floating in the air? Yeah, there sure is. Get up here. <laughs> That's the wrong music. You just vote looping carrot milk over again. Technically, the song is called... Wait, what's the name of the song? Night Vision Coffee. That's the name of the song. For anybody curious. The actual name of the song. <laughs> uh, all right. So Uno had a good suggestion for the floor pattern last week which was actually um instead of having a square mosaic on the floor i should have a, a circular mosaic on the floor just to keep that circle thing going oh yeah that's so i'm gonna point. give that a try so i was i was saying like a, a semicircle uh on the i, I think i want to take the roundness and just make it a full circle though because the yeah. whole room is, is round already so i i think i think that's a a solid idea right where uh, is no you circle? can't Wait, can you? Did we try this last week? No, you can't builders wand this, but you can something it, but it's fine. We're just doing it the old fashioned way. Remember when I told you to tear down that string thing? Probably don't tear down that string thing. I mean, I, I hadn't torn it down. Yeah, no, I, I, I didn't think you would, but. It's still going, it's still going. There we go. Right. Is this door bigger than the other doors? This is five. Yes, it is. It's definitely bigger than the other doors. Okay. All right. Yep, out of string. <laughs> this thing, <laughs> this dump project needs so much string. Oh, I got one. Whose dumb idea was this? Like the igloos oh, or the string? I mean, you're going to have to be more specific. String. We've got a lot of dumb ideas. 
specifically the string. Um, I mean, I couldn't think of another way to not make it snow up there. I mean, torches. Or other light sources. Well, torches would look... I mean, the problem with torches and light sources is it would obstruct the view as much as the snow would. Yeah. Because you'd look up and then they'd just be sitting there. Like, the advantage of string is it's not present. There is another plant that gives string 1 to 1 instead of 3 to 1. Oh, dang. We should be using that plant. I don't think we've got any flax. Also, your view's already obstructed by uh, solar panels up there. I think the solar panels are going to go around, not on top. I don't know. We need to figure that out. I do want to move all the solar panels over there at some point, too. It's yeah, my only hesitation with moving absolutely everything is then what do we do with the old igloos? But I suppose it's not the biggest deal. Like, we can we can find a home for them or repurpose them later to, like, individual homes and stuff like that. But, I mean, I think maybe the farming loo can stay what it is. I, yeah, again, I like so, like, the mob house. spawner one is fine. We don't need to move that. Right. And the farming right, one's right, fine. Right, right. But, like, okay. all the machine stuff I like having under sure. one roof. So, like all the storage, all the power generation and yeah. stuff. Oops, this. We need so that, much. That's completely wrong. String. Have we conquered the overworld in the name of the Nether yet? Mm, no. Hey, Metal Lupus, 74 months. That's a lot of months. That is a lot of months. Is anybody doing anything with the Nether in this server? No, because no, not really. the Astral Gateways pretty much replaced it. Or, or you know what I mean? Yeah. Normally you go to the Nether because you have Nether hubs or, or some kind of reason to do something in the Nether. Yeah. And that there's not really as much of a purpose for that. I've seen some people make builds um, on, like, the Sturgecraft community servers, which is kind of interesting, just for something to do there, but... Soon the nether will be cool again. Right? Yeah, the nether is going to be the new hotness in a little bit. One day. One day. Okay. Well, we're over halfway done up here, in terms of string. It did not take long, once those, uh, once those cloches are going. Uh, well, I've already used everything that was in the cloche. Take the frigging torches out of my offhand. Alright. So yeah, I'm trying to think of, like, a way to... I think at the top of the stairs here is where I want a bunch of the um, applied energistic stuff. Yeah, it's tricky. It's like, where do we want everything? There's also all this space down. This thing is huge. I feel like a lamp like, whoops, a lamp like that would probably work well like here, Surge, like a little bit. Way bigger things in the corner there. Just wait, just wait. I have a plan for that too. Because the problem, I think the issue with this is that that kind of just blends in with the staircase as you run towards it. That's good feedback. Like, as you run in, you, it's kind of hard. It's yeah, that's good feedback. Yeah, yeah. All right. Just letting you know. Uh, all right. Just ruining your dreams. No big deal. No big deal. Can't ruin him if he doesn't have any. So, yeah. How do we want to do... I mean, I guess we could do... Solar up here... Maybe we do do solar in the middle of the roof. It's like surrounded by... Um...
Sorry to buy relays and stuff. Yeah, solar by the, around the ring would be pretty hard. Um, because they all have each solar has to be touching a relay to actually transmit its power. So like how many one second, how many solar panels do we have right now that we can steal and take over here? Because that's what we're gonna do. So this is how the solar panels have to be kind of set up. If they're not touching one of these relays, they can't actually like move their power. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty. We have twenty-two solar panels right now to work with. And then what's the what's the circle right now? Oh, at the top, it's huge, but we could just basically recreate this. It's just going to be a lot smaller. Right. You know I'm going to have to, I'm, I think I'm going to have to take screenshots. Ow. Top one. Hadouken! It's Serge's favorite part. <laughs> that is my favorite part. Good job, James. Hadouken. All right. Um, so over here, or I guess we could actually put it, maybe we could just put them at the back. Maybe that would work, actually. All right, you know what? Also, getting the power down is going to be kind of fun. There's going to be a lot of lasers in this room, and I think that's actually going to look kind of badass. <laughs> so yeah, maybe we place a solar array at the back here. That could be cool. We also have access to a bunch of caves in the surrounding area too. So if we're ever worried about something not quite fitting the aesthetic on the inside, you know what I mean? Yeah. I'd like to renew my request that you investigate diversification and power. Solar panels will only produce eight flux per tick. Yeah, I know. The problem is, is that it's so hard to scale up in the limited time that we have. Uh, ow. That it's... I'm not super concerned about capping out our power usage right now, so... And we're not exactly using a huge amount of power. Yeah. What else do we have for power in this pack? Uh, so there are various, uh, actually, additions ones. So there's, like, canola oil, um, and you sort of expand on canola oil. Right. Uh, that's going, like, pure, pure, actually, additions. Then you've got, like, water wheels and windmills, that sort of thing. Yeah. This is an over... This is what it looks... The uh, top of the igloo looks like. I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> wow. Is that a new record? Wait. That That is a quick and early death. I'm impressed. All right, everybody, where your flat James is at? Come on. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> give me, give me them flat Jameses. That was definitely not intentional. Oh, right. Don't bunny hop. It's really hard not to do. But people have asked for me not to do it, so I try not to do it. Uh, placement? No, the other one. It's not looking too bad so far. 
Okay. Let's go steal all of our solar panels. Do, do, do. Well, that was beautiful. See, I know what I'm doing sometimes. All right. Ooh, we get more string too. Oh, we're actually just going to have to reuse the string over there, though. So, um, that one. Yeah, that's going to the left to right here. That's that um... one. Because they have... Oh, God. Hmm. All right. James, yeah. When you have a second, I have a couple of proposals for further interior decoration uh -huh. inside of the Gigaloo. All right. I, I, I mean, I trust you. Well, I've proposed two very different things. Um, one, which is a suggestion that you made. And one which is something completely different that I've made. Oh, well, um, then I, I would say go for the thing that I suggested, because it's probably better. I mean, <laughs> the thing I made kind of looks way cooler, though, which is why I wanted you to look at it. And I want I just want your affirmation to be like, you know what, Serge? Actually, I like your idea better than my own idea. Uh, all right. Sure. Let's pretend that's going to happen. Ben Smith! Six months! <laughs> Bold. Oh god! Oh, okay, good. Saved it. Yo! Wait. So on the left, we have the James Turner symmetrical retaining wall with the uh, permafrost brick. I on the right, uh, I've made a retaining wall, but of icicles. Oh, I see what you did there. I mean, I didn't. I just suggested a retaining wall. I didn't suggest that. I was just saying we should have a guardrail, you know, to be work safe. That being oh, said, you... nothing about this screams work safe. <laughs> 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 I think if you can bring it, okay, see like right here, this isn't work safe. So fix that gap I... and that but... one. But and, they look so much better. And this one and this one and this one. And then this will look cool. How, no, hold on. But this is how you use your Elytra. See, that's actually an access hole. What? You could just use your Elytra like this, though. But then you have to jump. See? See? There's the problem. No wonder you fall to your death so much. <laughs> yeah, because you put holes everywhere. No, this looks cool. I would definitely do this. Although, okay. Can we light it? We need we need light in this thing. I know, I know. I'm thinking about that. I haven't gotten there that yet. I want because uh, reminder that the floor is still ice. Yeah. So and... here's what here's what I'm thinking. Um, okay. Floating sh floating like hanging lights right about here. So like chain so chain down from the question. ceiling, and just hanging somewhere in midair. Yeah. Um, so question for you. Are you willing to do the math to make sure that we don't melt the ice? Uh, no. That's what I thought. <laughs> That's isn't that why you're here? The math? No, I, I don't. Really I don't math. math. I heard I, you're really good yeah, at it, though. That. That's what 
they call me Serge Good at Math Jaeger. Every time I read subs or anything, people are like, wow, Serge, you and numbers. It's like a perfect pairing. All right. So how are we how are we gonna do the solar panel thing? So I think uh we need okay, so I think we want it centered okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So this is center. Uh the great word lane for nine months. That's almost as many fingers as I have. Nice. Uh, yeah, just give me a sec, so I'll, I'll grab some. My man. We can't put a star con- sorry, we can't really put a star constellation. Oh, stars are the nodes plus four panels. I mean, we could do that. We don't- we're not really doing any, like, constellation work, though, so I think it's just gonna look kind of weird if we do that. Like, it's a neat idea. And I think if you were deep into astral sorcery and into the constellation stuff, that would- fit in well with your with what you were doing but we aren't so i think i'm just gonna go with something a little bit more symmetrical for now so it's like we can go here and then we can go here two out two out two out and two out and again just make it keep it pretty pretty easy for now yeah no i'm i'm not planning to round out the entire jiggaloo today <laughs> Sounds like a fool's errand. So we can just do like this for now, which I think looks, should look kind of neat from down below. Like that looks cool. It looks like a snowflake. We did it. Okay, that does look really cool from down below. Ah! I like step one, um, remove, place string to remove all snow. Step two, place solar panels to mimic snow. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, maybe we can do another one. We don't have the solar panels for that right now. We only have two solar panels left, so. Yeah, now we need to put string. Keep need to do need to do more string work. Oh shoot, can somebody sleep? I got you. Sorry, this is just quite intricate. Thank you. The light does help, though. James, do you have a satchel? No. Uh, James, do you have a sleeping bag? No. James, I'm going to take a second to make you a satchel and a sleeping bag, if you'd like. Otherwise, I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, I, I, appreciate I, I can do that. It's fine. I just, I just okay. haven't. I know. I know. Just wanted to check in first, because, you know, it's important to ask. Ooh, I get the scary cave noise oh, inside see. of the uh, the jiggaloo right now, and you walk around, and oh, it's just nice. like, yeah, that's good stuff. Ow. 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 No! <sighs> <laughs> that's two. Why didn't my Elytra activate? Wait, maybe my Elytra are broken. Get your bets in. Get your bets in now. Betting closing soon. How many deaths today? 30, 40. We could set a record. Kobe! Oh, that was not even close. Also, now that's just sad when you yell that. And it's so built into me. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Uh... Yeah. I think maybe uh, I think I'm actually just. Yep, gonna... my elite are broken. That's why. Get rid of the whole thing. Uh, Robin Bolas, hundred bits. Thank you so much for those bits. Appreciate it. 
I think that actually looks better like that. All right, now let's go fix my Elytra. And also make sure that we're getting string still because we need more. Maybe I should try to do like a bonus. Oh, yeah, right. So these need power. There. All right. Have we seen Harvey Milk recently? No, not really. Harvey Milk does his own thing. So I don't think that's too bad on the outside or on the tops. Whoops. Yeah, I just need to cut into that underside a bit. Alright, my Elytra is fixed. Everybody can stop worrying. Yeah, the I rabbit think died. Maybe. Like. I have to this looks there. so cool. This looks so cool. You should come take a look at what this uh, this whole room looks like now that it's. Oh, this entrance looks good. Oh yeah, nice. Look at that, right? And so here's the circular pattern in the floor. Uh, we have the complete surround with icicles that act as a safety barrier where no one can possibly fall to their death. TM. <laughs> I'm sure someone will find a way. James uh, uh, finds a way. Ow. Ow. Yeah, that looks, uh, that looks a lot better than... Ow. Uh, most of the white, it just breaks up the... <laughs> Breaks up the shape a bit. Yeah, if anybody's curious, the string is to stop the snow from uh, accumulating on the glass and breaking our, our lovely view. Hey! Come on. Oh my god. Uh, there is string over the solar panels. It's hard to see, but it's there. So we're good. We got lots. Of Wait. So these all have energy. Are the relays supposed to have energy in them? Uh, you might not see the energy in them. Oh, okay.
go. Uh, assuming you use a light source with the same radius as a torch 14, you would need to have them at least four blocks above the ice. Yeah, they'd be way above the ice. It shouldn't be a problem. I think it'll be fine. And then maybe a four here. One, two, three, four, like that. <sighs> We're so close. All right, just a little bit more, a little bit more string. <sighs> Perfect. Yo, we did it. Oh, no, we didn't. Yo, we did it. <laughs> I think, I think it's going to be easier to check from below, I think, actually. Yeah, I think we're good. Yeah, actually, like, uh, I mean, it's too much solar, but yeah, four of these here would actually look really cool. Um, all right, so now we need to actually get some lasers going. I think that looks pretty good. Uh, there is not string on top of the relays, but I don't think we need them. <laughs> Easiest way to check is to drop a bucket of water and count how much string drops. Uh, <laughs> you're a monster. All right. Um, so, yeah, we need to get l the laser beam down to, like, here. Uh, how do we do that? So, do you want to come and just admire this door? Uh, um, one sec. Thank you. Mm, wondering if that underside needs to be just flat instead of that in. Yeah, do you have a piece of snow? Nice. Uh, the point of pu putting the string there is so that snow doesn't pile up on top of our lovely glass ceiling. Solar Blitz, thanks for that 15 month resub. Exclamation string. Yes, we have a reason. <laughs> yeah, there is a point no, to this. We, we decided to make a string farm purely for the aesthetics. This looks good. Nice, you know. Um, if I may make a suggestion. This is absurd. Yeah, that's why that's mostly why I invited you over here. Could you bring it out like this way? Um sorry, I mean uh, like extend it. How does he a little bit further? This... I think it's a little stubby considering the size of the gigaloo. Yeah, that that that's the easy part. This was But the... like the actual curve looks fantastic, friend. Yeah, the that that was the hard part. Heck yeah, it's... thank you very much. Cool. I wow, you didn't hit me once. I'm so <laughs> bad at this. It doesn't do any knockback. No, I, I'm just going to assume that you just missed me this entire time. 
Oh, James. Uh, how much do we want? Do we want like another three? Two or three. All right. Um. So now that I'm done upstairs, right? We need to figure out the lasers. How do we? How does it? How did this work over here again? So the way that this worked is. Right. So that that's three. Uh crap. So this is just a relay, right? Yeah, these are just relays. Okay, so what do we need to connect relays with again? Uh the Phantom laser wrench. Uh, the laser wrench. Laser wrench! You should have one, at, at least. Uh, laser wrench requires this. Nope. Okay. Got that. And iron. Curling, go. Oh, shoot. That's not going to get there. Thank you. Let's go grab some more snow. Wrench, laser wrench. There we go. Okay, we got a laser wrench. Let's grab some snow blocks for building up to where we need to go. Okay. It's not nighttime apparently. snow in the compacting drawer. We've got through this snow. Um, Considering how much there was before. I don't think I've seen this. Don't think you've uh, seen what? Just give it, give it a minute. Oh, Uno's magical snow thing? Yeah. yeah it's kind of neat, eh? That's pretty as heck. Is it going to turn it into pack? Ah, nice. So we're actually, we're actually out of ice, regular ice. Right, 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 right. We, we knew that last week. Yeah, that's, that's where, that's where the problem is at the minute. How is it not nighttime yet? Though, didn't we have... I'm sure we had, like, a load of ice somewhere, didn't we? Um, we've got a little bit of ice that we collected inside of the Gigaloo. Um, a thousand. A thousand is not a lot. <laughs> oh, crap. I did not mean to do that! Oh, good god. Okay, well, that was stupid. It's in in the Gigaloo somewhere. Yeah, there's a compacting drawer. Oh yeah, there's literally a clock right there. Lol, I'm an idiot. Right, do you need do you need this ice? Uh no. No, you can turn literally all of it into other things if you'd like. Right. Okay, what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna put the ice into your shulker box. Because what I'm going to do is bind to your shulker box, so your shulker box will start filling with packed ice as I change it over. Okay. 
How far away can we put this? I'm centered, right? Yeah, I'm centered. So can we put this right here and connect, do you think? What's the easiest way of doing this? Laser stored. There is a uh, limit on the distance. Yeah, I just don't know what that is, so. It's like 16 blocks. Can't I think. connect. The relays are either part of the same network, the stored relay isn't the same type, or it doesn't exist anymore, or is too far away. That is super unhelpful. <laughs> Probably it's too far away. That doesn't even seem that far. Oh, it's six. Oh, I didn't realize it was that. I thought it was further than that. All right. Well, range extent. Is this what we need? Laser relay modifier range. Okay. So let's make a few of these. How difficult are they to make? Because they don't look too hard. realize that this is not going to work for much longer. <laughs> Laser. Okay. Need three of these. One, two, three. Two compasses. And we made it. Okay. So we have two. Didn't work. Didn't work. Okay, so this goes in this one and the... Wait. Do I need to put it in both? Is that how that's going to work? I'm not sure. I've never actually used them. I would assume that I'd have to... Okay, there's one. How do I actually... Okay, so that one's in there. And then let's go like this. Okay, you can see it like that. That's cute. With the wrench. So, laser stored. And then let's go like this. Ow. And what could possibly go wrong? Almost dead. <laughs> uh, Y'all saw that. I was really close. Okay, so that still says they can't connect. But it doesn't tell me why. It tells me too many reasons. Why can't it just say it's too far? It's probably too far. The range upgrade didn't work? Why Why would the range upgrade not work? Wait, why is that range upgrade not in there? Put the range update in the closest to the relay instead of the middle. Oh, I guess that's true. Yeah, I could do that. Why does it not look like that range is in there?
place. Okay, so that that works. The way disconnect it. I think I might have to break this one. Okay, so stored down. meticulous work here. Perfect. No. Okay. So... closer? See, the rain... the range upgrade didn't come back to me on that one either, which is kind of weird, right? Gonna go here. I mean, we're gonna have to make a chain of relays. Yeah, the range extender should have dropped. And it's not in there. And it's not coming out of there. Huh. Like... Ow. Why... Where did my range go? Now I'm con... <sighs> this sucks. Bitter one, thanks for 35 months, and King Slayer 67883831 months. Appreciate it. Uh, right. I guess it could have gone through the roof. You're looking for a range extender. Yeah. Ow. No, don't think it went through the roof. Right, Apparently hang. it's a known bug and you should just cheat some into replaced. Hmm. Well, in the meantime... Uh... Yeah, I can't immediately pick it up anyway. Try this again. Okay. Wait, this doesn't even see... This doesn't see it anymore. It seems things buggy. Because now I don't see it on this, on this relay anymore. And it was floating there before. Uh, hang on. Oh, there are my fireworks. Like, yeah. The string shouldn't be a problem. Okay, so there, okay. So there, it's in that one now. So now let's go back down here. Get back up onto our perch. Oh, yeah, yeah, I can see that one with the modifier on. Ah! Ah! <laughs> All right, who had your money on three? Uh, That's three! Son of a... We're averaging three an hour. If you're a betting person, odds of nine are pretty good here. It's 11.02. That was into the next hour. Uh, you didn't start playing until, uh... Fair. <sighs> I'm also out of rockets, too. Everything sucks. 
Yo, VT Mark. Thank you for the 20 months. Appreciate it. If I remember rightly, the other... They're fine. Why would you not... <sighs> oh god, I'm out of rockets. No! Ooh, eerie cave noise. Hi. Um, do, do you want something? <laughs> Whoops! I, I turned on sticky keys. <laughs> uh, is it is it carrots? Are you hungry? I, I see you taking some damage. <laughs> no, I'm good. I got food. Uh, is it leather so you can repair your elytra? I mean, I'm not gonna say no. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh dang! Uh, Look at all these. All right. Okay. Okay. Turn around. Nice. Got it. Okay. Put you in there. What? What? I. Okay. we go lasers first laser complete that's a pretty impressive like weird nose structure you've made up there yeah okay so that's laser number one uh let's go do this are you gonna write like a giant message in the sky like surge is cool with lasers? But like in lasers? No. That's not currently the plan. Let's break. Well, then, I mean, dream big. Let's break this block. Oh, never mind. Can't break, break that block. <laughs> That's an exterior block. That's not an interior one. They're all exterior blocks. It's, it's a load bearing block. Actually, that's a very good question. Can we color the lasers? Uh, uh, no. You can get blue lasers, but that's fluid, and green lasers, which are items. Alright, so now we need to go, like, we need to get another laser down here. Ah! I missed. Yeah, you did. If I go here, nope. Okay. So now, keeping in the middle. Oh, shoot. Can I reach that laser? I don't know if I can reach it. I might have been stupid there and. That's fine. Okay. So now we can go. From that laser to, we'll say, here? Can we go farther than that? We should be able to go farther than that. I'd like to go down to there. Perfect. Perfect. Yo, Ben Anderson. Uh, 36 months, three years. And Robin Bolas for the 100 bit says, Tell Surge I said hello. Yo. Okay. So that's there.
And then we're probably going to need more relays, but I don't have any more. So down we go for now. Don't melt. Don't okay. melt. What's the water melting point of ice? Mm -hmm. Light level 10. Oh, I was going to say zero degrees. <laughs> I that oh, how does that, what does that what does that translate to in uh in minecraft uh it's like yeah it's like 10 or 11 or something yo live with cake 36 months welcome back okay uh so we've got okay we're getting power in here which is good i think we need to come down one more and then we're gonna start and then we start sort of going around with the lasers so let's go get some more uh relays 273.15 Kelvin. All right, so I'm just kind of fumbling about here, trying to think of how I want to make the pillars in the corner. I was dreaming really big, and now that it's coming time to actually, um, like, write that check that my mouth has already cashed, I'm really <laughs> struggling. <clears throat> so... I made a couple of like little tiny lights and they just didn't work, but I kind of liked the promise and I tried to make a, like a stone tower, almost like a lighthouse, and then I hated it. So I just made a giant ice sculpture and I slapped sea lanterns on it and I don't know, I need some validation or some feedback or something. I just, I just can't. Hello? <laughs> Matt with silence. <laughs> Hold on. One second, I'll come over there and take a look in a moment. I'm just getting some Hello. energy relays. Ooh, I got Please. some golden carrots. Please validate my parking. Your parking is valid. Oh, brilliant. Okay. Uh, right, where are we looking? In the in the corners around the circle. Wait, a circle can't have corners. Uh, I mean, it kind of is. An entire, so, uh, an, just so all this, corners. This is my first one. And then, and then I made it bigger. And then I realized I hated all the brick and I just made it with ice. So these are your three options. This one. Look, I tried to make a big stone tower and it looked really weird and really out of place. So I, so I like, I, I like, I like the shape of this one. Yeah. The problem is but... when you take that and you try and make it bigger, it looks dumb. So like this kind of looks like I feel uh, like this needs your station in Firewatch or something, this, right? This like, needs some stone, yeah, I think. I, no, well, I was trust me, say, I made it with stone as well, and it also looked weird. The other thing is, so is what that... I was going to say, instead of in, in, instead of being four pillars on the outside, what if it was one central pillar that it stood on? That would make it smaller, not bigger. I think. Yeah, but it would still make it taller. I think my issue is that it's too far. Like, it feels like it needs to be like here where I'm standing, not there. Because it's like it's under, so it's what underneath if, okay, this overhang, right? I could take right? a smaller, I could take a smaller version of this um, and then I could make this like line the path into the base. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I always know what you're saying. Whoa, that was weird. So that is that is the taller version that Uno is asking for. You see, I, I think that looks better. I think the ice is maybe a bit much on it. But I'm thinking of them being like sort of lantern type things, you know, like lamps, street lamps type things. The old gas lamp. Yeah, the issue is it wasn't supposed to be a gas lamp. It was supposed to be a large support structure that's holding up the side. And then again, the ice being as thick as it is right now kind of justifies it. Do we like the idea of large no way ice work, spires right? sort of in the corner holding things up? So, I mean, picture that in the corner and then I can move those, um, what do you call that, a road lamp Ooh, in a bit? Step. Yeah, I think it wants to come forwards maybe about where this torch is. 
you're 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 not answering the question I asked no so That's yeah we'll use we'll use street lamps and we'll put those wherever um but what do we think of the massive ice spikes holding up the side yeah I'm already on board with making a bunch of street lamps and like lining things about so you're talking about this yes the the giant ice spike it doesn't necessarily have to have light on it maybe it'll look better without light on it I don't know a little bit of light on it, it kind of looks good. Yeah, I mean, yeah, the concept is... Too far. Yeah. Yay. Thank you, friend. Appreciate it. It's a shame the uh, packed ice, like is so opaque yeah the issue is if it wasn't i couldn't put lights on it if it was slightly yeah, transparent yeah, yeah. it'd be neat but regular ice melts <laughs> yeah that's the that's the the issue because you kind of want it to make it like the ice is frozen over the lamp oh that it that's actually well that's a lot of the designs i had was it'd be cool if i could make a structure on the inside and then encase it in ice and that just never happened it just doesn't work the way we yeah. want it to there we go and you're right it it is transparent we got some right. lasers pew, pew. but i'm outside the draw distance of mm, cold tea yum 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 yeah, so you could... Will ice bits melt into water bits in your light? So ice bits won't. So that that is certainly a thing, but that's a whole extra problem. Alright, so... Do we have enough room back here for... We just might, actually. We'll need to build a... Oh, oh. hmm... I guess if we did a... Ow! It's fine. <laughs> Squark! Is that all the solar from the other igloo? Yep. Cool. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to upgrade this battery. Upgrade which battery? So we have a battery here. Oh, yeah. That's, that's our power storage. Wait, why is it so just floating? Why is it? Because uh, it's on the battery box. That's how they look. Oh, interesting. Um, so hold on. So. So it's a triple battery. Battery. And then you put it on the battery. So you just, it's a battery box with one of these batteries on it? Yep. Yeah, yeah. So that's a triple battery that you have there? That's a double battery. So I was going to make turn it into a triple battery. Screw that. Let's so turn it into a quintuple battery. Here we go. Uh, I mean, it has to go into a triple battery first. So. Yeah. Are you, okay. I can do that. Okay. Well, there's some iron. All right, hold on. Triple you'll battery. Need, in fact, you'll need to do. You'll need to empower two iron blocks. Because the quadruple battery needs empowered in Ori as well. Oh, okay. Uh. All right. 
We're we're slowly moving into the gigaloo. Uh, all right. Uh, so. So you need gray. Empowered. Inori is. Uh, snowball, gray, button, cobblestone. Right. So snowball, we have one. Uh, button, we have them. Uh, cobble, we have... And we had gray dye? Do we have more? Yep. We got gray dye. Okay. So let's go like this and like this. Battery, triple battery. There we go. Uh, Chef of Death, thanks for the 54 months. Oh, I can have your support, but... <laughs> you can have my support, my money, my wife, but you cannot have my peanut butter, Nutella, and banana pancakes. That's fair. Quite the line to draw. <laughs> no, you gotta have I don't know if they know just how much I love Nutella. Like, is there room for haggling? Yeah. <laughs> Uno. Yeah. Have we found a way to automate and or scale up pack dice? Not. Yeah, no. That's the. <laughs> All I right. managed to do ice. Oh, I didn't realize the box is full of packed eyes. Oh, you're the best. Thank okay. you, base Uno. Triple. Whoops, that's not how you spell triple battery. So, triple battery. Right, the double battery is in the system now. Ah. Okay, so that's going to get us a triple battery. And then quadruple battery, triple, it's just a quadruple battery. Apparently there's no space in this thing. And then Quinn. Requir Quintuple needs empowered the diamond. diamond. Right. Do we have any of that? Do we have, oh, we don't. Need clay and light blue, and that's diamonds, right? Yeah, but you only need you only need one block of it, so you could do it. We have some light blue dye, uh, and we have plenty of clay, so you could you could empower a block of diamond team. Okay, uh, so it's a diamond block. Uh, so we've got... Wait, we have diamond at crystal. We can just go yeah, like this. So you need to empower that. Yeah, and then we need... Clay. We need one... Two pieces of clay and a piece of clay. And then light blue dye. Yo, Manfred909, thanks for that 42-month resub. Appreciate it. There we go. Uh, I've still got plenty of power in my battery here. All right, so right now we have a million crystal flux battery, and now this I think is going to make a two million. Yep. And that's the biggest battery you can get. Bam. Quintuple battery. This is out of power. All right, so let's take this battery box. And head back over here. So we can start powering up this battery box. Uh, right, I'll stop. Should I start breaking down these other machines and the empower and stuff? Um, yeah, I work, let's get um, some of the um, AE2 stuff over here. Because that's what's going to okay. go, go at the top of the stairs, so. 
Okay, I'll bring the, the A2 stuff, so at least we can start. So we need... Oh, I need another... I have realized. Okay, cool. Um... Ooh, those look good. I like those, Search. Oh, that's what I like to hear. Yeah, validation. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> and just steal a few... Permafrost bricks, I guess, for just a second. Yeah, help yourself to whatever bricks and anything you need in there. I'm just gonna make this look better later, but... So now. I want you to know I've never built anything like this before, kind of ever. And I'm really loving how this is coming together. And I like I like the sort of organic shape we have. So the ice overtaking a lot of the structure we have on the inside is the more I'm adding, the cooler and cooler it is. So yeah. <laughs> there we go. It is very dark up here, I'm sorry. Not really much I can do about that right now. Yeah, if we had if we had light, we're gonna melt all the ice that I insist on using. Uh, <laughs> if we want to, now that we have infinite sand and as much light blue dye as we have bone meal, which we functionally have infinite as well, we could make the entire floor at the top here um, one consistent blue glass instead of ice. It'll have a different texture and it won't be quite as transparent, but we could light it up and there won't be any risk of it melting. Downside, uh, we can't play curling. So I have really been enjoying the ability to sort of just like curl things to one another, but I would understand if <laughs> at this point you're like, you know what, Serge? It's actually not that important that we, that we have the ability to curl things to one another. I don't know, Uno, as our resident non-Canadian, how have you been enjoying the Canadian national sport of... Um... I like I like curling. I, I, I really enjoy curling. I like the actual sport as well. <laughs> uh, I do you like uh, the ability to curl right. every item we have to one another here. Wait, why is it not going up anymore? Oh, is it, it's night time. Yeah, that's why. So we need a, okay, so we should figure out a better way. Where do you want the AE2 stuff? I don't know yet. <sighs> oh, so I just dump it all in a chest and then. Just put it all in the chest for now. I go grab a chest. Because right now, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go back into our tunnels. And I'm going to steal a lot of this cable that we aren't using right now. So that we can still have access to all of our drawers for now. Um, ooh, bad panda bear. Thanks for that. Uh, 26 months sub. Appreciate it. Uh, what do you okay. do? Should I just set up the? Oh no, we need yeah. all the cable, all the cabling over here as well. That's we? what I'm. That's what I'm working on right now. Right, I'm just gonna put it in a chest by the door to start with. I just realized these lamps are the perfect example of why I should have a copy pasta tool. Yeah. Like, oh my god. Yeah. I could just be I could just be blooping these all over the place. Do you want mine? Uh I'll have to learn how to use it, but yes. Okay, I second. think I do. Give me a second. Uh I've got mine on me, Serge, if you want it. Oh, there you go. Please. Alright, I'm gonna learn how to use the new mod here. Uh let me know if it runs out of power or anything. Okay. I'm right clicking it, nothing's happening. Uh, press and hold G. 
and that will turn it into so you can put it into copy or paste mode. It's in paste mode. I can see a machine you right. have there. So you want to change it into copy mode. How do I do that? So press and hold G and then go over to copy. And you should it's not bringing up a menu when I press and hold G. Um, uh, that's if you rebound G. Yeah, it's try um, uh, the comma or sorry, apostrophe. Yeah, no, my keybinds are all messed up. For this oh, one. Okay. All right. Uh, it's called settings menu. In the, um, in the, not enough keys. Interesting. The default is C. Oh, weird. Ah, shoot. That's weird. Which is conflicting with a bunch. To same as the. All right, let's get rid of corporea request. Yeah, you're not gonna need that. Okay, so that's all that. So now let's. God, every single off. app uses the letter C. Are you kidding me? Every single app. Yeah, they but all want the letter if C. If you're if you're holding the item and you press and hold C, it should know because it should nope. be at it, least it. a bit contextual. Okay. Okay. So the question is, how are we gonna? What? Okay, I I have an idea actually. Aha. All right, hacker voice. I'm in. All right, we want copy. And then you should be able to click like the bottom left and the top right, and you should see a box. The area is too large. Uh, you might need to clear it because uh, it might need. If you shift click the shift right click it in the air, that should clear it. The only mod that I've done is the Diary Wolf 21 and just started Searchcraft 2. What's Hermitcraft? Hermitcraft is not a mod pack, it's a group of people who play. Whoa, jeez. It's, it's For a, a second, your head was on backwards. Hermitcraft is a group of like 20, 20 or so uh, creators, YouTubers, mostly YouTubers, um, who just play on the same server. Ah, shoot. Okay, so uh, actually this is fine because what we want to do is go back here and yeah go back here how do i get the preview uh so if you put it into paste mode yeah and then you should just be able to point it at the ground yeah it's not giving me a preview of what it is though uh can i get the thing back and just check oh shoot i should have figured out what level this is at so you, you've copied just keep going down here. There, that's probably good. There. Oh! I'm not sure it's, has it got anything saved? Woo. They do do vanilla. They are a vanilla server. I mean, they, they do some things, but mostly aesthetic. No game-changing stuff. Uh, okay, so yeah, I'll add some custom blocks for heads. Yeah, add. custom. Oh. Yeah, they do that to do um, like an armor stand mod, so they can. The armor stand mod's really cool. Jason wanted us to add that to a vanilla server for a while too. Just yeah, for there aesthetics. you go. Thank you, Uno. So you should you should be able to see the uh, outline of it now. So the outline I see is actually for an IE machine. Oh, oh never mind. It updated. Weird. Probably very dark. Do I have? I have torches. So you should be able to do things like rotate it and. Uh, oh God! Yeah. Oh, no. Let's 
None of it. So I think there's a button for edit placement, and you can put it down. There you go. Did I actually not just dig deep down enough here? Hmm? Or is it that it's so freaking big that I'm just not there yet? Ah, there it is. Found it. Okay. The answer was number two. <laughs> <laughs> It's very big. How much more? Okay, I've got... Oh god, we only have, I only have 45. Not enough. God. Okay. Oh, you're sending the cable along. Yeah. You need more cable. I will, yeah. Can just steal some cable i think it's going to be fine because i just want to connect this up to our storage drawers for now because we're not going to move those anytime in the next <clears throat> okay i need one cable Pretty that up. Okay. So let's go steal some more cable. Hey, all this lost has going. I didn't have context for what a shop in a multi it's in a multi oh okay, sure, sure. Look at this! Oh god, it looks so cool. Ah, I'll have to come look at that in a minute. All right, so we have nothing. So we tore out those cables, so. So we're actually running low on Certus, so I'm gonna go do some mining. This is fine. Right, we can steal a whole bunch of cable that we're not. Hey, Uno, mm -hmm. I have literal hundreds of Certus crystals in my base. Here, do you wanna come with me? I'm not using it anytime soon, so why don't we just oh, yeah, pinch yeah, yeah. all that? Okay. Do you have um? Do you have storage on you, like a shulker box or something that can carry it? Oh, I need. Uh, I've got portable stuff. All right, here, follow me. I also have a sack and stuff. I realize you don't have to follow me, but at least if I show you where it is in my base and we need more in the future, you can just grab it. Where is? The... Sorry, I don't know where the astral portal is anymore. <laughs> the base uh, has grown too big. Here. I can't find it. Yeah, this Find isn't me. even connected to anything. So let's. Steal. Um, you have to go through a base that starts with the letter A to find uh, my base. Wait, what? <laughs> the way the portals work, it never really links one to one, so you oh, have to figure right. out um, you have to figure out like what steps you can take to jump. Okay. Ah, so... There we go. Found you. Uh, so right here near Toasty Bean, you'll find a bunch of uh, sort of stuff. Oh god, I had more than I thought I did. You can take it all. Uh, James, do we need um, skeleton spawners, zombie spawners, and or spider spawners? No. Okay. Just checking. Cool. Oh, I don't have all that. Yeah, if there's anything else you see in that box, that, like, honestly, you know, if you're ever missing anything, um, take a look at that box. Oh, go to uh, Serafina's mining operation, mining outpost, and then that links to the mine o'clock base on the way back. Serafina's. Uh, 
it's over there. You can see mine. <laughs> cool. Right, that should be pretty so good. Uh, what's Nether Quartz while we're here? Spider spawners get you string? Yeah, we don't need string anymore. We're all <laughs> strung out. Alright. Really? Can we not? Huh. Why am I ripping up the stuff? Um, because I need it to connect up the new base and we can reconnect later. N everything I've ripped up wasn't actually connected to anything. It was all future proofing. Um, but this is more important. I have I have this stuff here to craft you like a bunch more cables as well. I've got some more cables, so I'll let you know how many we need here. I think we're going to need an energy cell on this thing at some point. Fiber. Do you want to send that in the wall? Sorry? And we can. Did you want to send that in the wall and then we can put facades on it? Uh, no, I have an idea for how to make it look kind of... How, how to make it look kind of interesting. Yeah, the energy cells... Energy cells are not too bad. Okay. Yeah, that's not too bad, though. Too bad. Uh, what have we got tons of? Okay. So. Approximately how much glass do you think we need if we wanted to make that entire interior? A lot? Uh, four stacks? Yeah, four four stacks? Long. That's it? Nah, a lot more than that. All right, because I've been, I've actually been kind of quietly collecting glass as we go there, and I've got, I think, close to 17 stacks. Okay. So what I want, okay, we're going to have to. God, this looks so cool when you go into it now. Gah! Sorry. I'm very excited, <laughs> and I'm going to try and tone it down a little bit. Let me finish this and look even better. So we're flying and then we come into the base. Oh yeah, look at this. This is really good. Yeah, we definitely need to figure out. Okay, so. So what I was thinking of for down here. Thank you, that was actually one of the things I was going to ask for. Yeah, I'll do it on the other side as well. Come on. was weird.
can I just get into that block of snow there? Uh, yeah. Oh, the one up top. Can you get to it from... Oh, yeah. No, just... I'm going to need to break the glass just briefly. That's fine. No. What? Why did you want to? Why did you place that? Yeah. Nice. All right. So that's looking kind of cool. And then we come up here, and we need to kind of make so. If I break this um, battery, I'm not going to lose any of it, right? Nope. Okay. You can take the uh, you can take the battery off, and it will stay because it's just an item in your inventory. So what if we do this, and then this battery box there? Couple battery back on top. How about that? So then you don't have the battery box sort of like floating. Yeah. Um, and then, so we're gonna do this, this, um, and then uh, for now, let's just do this. We can push. We can push any of this stuff back. It's just that's where the battery box was. Yeah. I, I, for now, I'm just gonna quickly boop, uh, boop, and that goes in there, and then. this for a second. Uh, I think, uh, trying to think. How will it look? Oh, have you got some permafrost? Uh, no. He it's down in the uh, box. There we go. A little bit of a permafrost. Bricks. Lasers transfer power. What are you doing? Oh, you're making okay, yeah. Well, I was gonna go. Oh, I need more. One second, you know. I had I have an idea here as well. Just to create a little storage room up here for this. Put sea lanterns in those corners, actually. I think that'd be all right. Yeah, as long as you're four blocks above the ice, it shouldn't melt it. You know what? I'm actually just going to go turn this all into blue glass. Let's let's just do that. Let's let's do away with the problem of one of our layers melting due to my <laughs> stubbornness. 
Uh, Uno, I'm going to return to your coffee pasta tool. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. That was, that saved me a lot of time. this up. There's an interesting comment in chat, Uno, about sea lanterns potentially producing more light than a torch. So I would, if you're going to put uh, sea lanterns there, double check the light level, maybe bump them up by one. The light level where I am here is 10. So that should be all right. I think we said 11. Uh, 10 is the bad spot. Okay, I'll send them up by one then. Oh, do you have to extend this up by a bit? Uh, apparently. Just to put a sea lantern there and there. And that's actually not too bad than just sort of sitting on the top. Nines, yep. And do we want to encase them like that? How's that look? Ooh, hang on. Hey, Sarah. Um. So this is a fun little start. Is there a point in which I should start decorating the exterior? Oh, you know what we haven't done for the Gigaloo, which the other Loos have, mm -hmm. uh, is exterior windows. Oh yeah, that's actually yeah. yeah, yeah. And that's gonna that's gonna make a pretty huge difference, especially if... maybe at the top of the stairs. What actually? That will make it light. What if we replace? Are you watching my stream right now, Serge? Yeah. What if we replaced? these blocks oh the whole like exterior perfect circle looking ones yeah what if we did like yeah those five and then these whatever and then those so my only reason for potentially name that would be if we're using the connected texture glass it won't be smooth in that particular one versus yeah. when you look at the ceiling and it's all smooth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yes. One thing that I think would be really nice there though is that that would let that would lighten up those areas a lot. So, um give me one second here. All right. So the So this is this is a cute little start. It's it's whatever. It, it's it's fine. It looks pretty angry. Yeah. It's a nice little <laughs> Little happy face. It's fine. So you're looking at your your little. You've made a beautiful teddy bear there. Um, let me know what you think of this. Let me know if you hate this or not. Oh yeah, you can do whatever you want. Oh, you're doing the glass. I mean, do you I prefer. I think we probably just, out of sheer like annoyance, probably want to just do glass, right? Yeah. But do you do you like the look of it? Yeah, it looks. It, the thing is, is it looks almost the same. Yeah, yeah, it yeah, really it does. And then guess what, Uno? We're going to have literal thousands more ice that we can turn into converted ice. Hooray! Hey. It's a Christmas miracle. All right, so we've got... So this is sort of our central ME crafting area, and obviously this will expand. Um, and we have access to everything, which is nice, because we are connected. Do you, want to, do you want me to Wait. put stuff in there? We are not connected. Why are we not connected to... Oh, there it goes. 
Wait, are we connected? Yeah, we, are we connected to our bins? Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah, we are. Okay, yeah, 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 we are. We Does the are. charging machine still get power in the old ME one, or have we moved all that? It's all moved. There is no power uh, over there. So right where now. do I go to charge my Presto change a switch of Matic? Um, we need to figure that out. Oh wait, no, no, no. There, there still appears to be power here. Um, actually, yeah. Oh, uh, oh, yeah. It's getting a little bit of power. It's not quite as much juice as before, but you know, it's respectable. Are you in the other loo? Because I can just hold. I'm in the original here. power loo. What's the uh, ener is it energizer? Is that what it's called? Uh, yes. Yeah, the we energizer. Need... Okay, let's make an energizer. We could just bring the energizer over. Oh, do we have one? Yeah, that's oh, okay. what we were using to charge. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring the energizer over, and then we can use that here. Hey, hey welcome back, Mama. Do we have enough power? Yeah, we have enough power for what we're doing right now. You can actually see our power right there. Just going to retrieve a couple of relays as well. So, Uno, you'll be happy to know that 14 down right stacks now, but... of glass got me one third. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, a third. So maybe 40 stacks wasn't far off. Any cool looking uh, doors that we could put in here? I was uh, uh, just just looking at uh... right. Energizer is in there. There are a couple of relays in the system as well now. Oh, hey. where where did it go? Why? What is this giant ice hole just in the floor that... Who doesn't fix... Uh, Where? Ugh. Where are you? The old ME room. Somebody just ripped something out of the floor, <laughs> and now there's literally, like, water cascading everywhere. No, that, that would time be... to fix that. We've been out of ice. God, Uno. I, I, All yeah. right. The, the Energizer is, is <laughs> here. And it needs power, right? So I think we can go here. Yeah. So I've given uh, there's a couple more relays in the system. Do I just connect this one to here? Yeah, we can just do that. Does that Is that going to keep charging this though? Yeah, so the energizer will fill up and then it will stop. Yeah, okay, so that will keep working. Okay, that's fine then. All right, so the Energizer is right here, Surge. Okay, thank you. I do like the idea, I really like the idea, actually, um, of maybe in a stream or two, each of us takes one of these now hollowed out okay, big lose and turns it into our own personal home i think we might have to copy pasta one more because we have the we have the farm one and the guardian farm one and the mob farm one so just like yeah i don't know i think that's a really cool and fun idea yeah uh none of these doors i think one complaint we've had in past minor clocks is we never actually and maybe this is just true of minecraft in general we don't often take time to actually make like a proper house for ourselves you know what i mean I mean, that's never really been something I do. Yeah, me neither. Right. Oh, pardon me. All right. Uh, let's make a bunch. How about, how about that? How about that for a door? How would you do? Oh, yeah, that, that looks good. Because I assume you want to put more stuff in here. Well, just access to it is going to be useful. And this is just yeah. for now. This is probably going to expand. So, um, okay. So, what time is it? It's noon. So we got lots of time left. Um, what's the big glowy thing for applied energistics? The big glowy thing. Yeah. Uh, what? 
<laughs> the controller? Is it the controller? Yeah, these blocks right here. The future, or the, the, f we want these, the Emmy controller, right? Udo, yeah, I'm yeah. so impressed that you were able to translate what James meant there. I'm, I just, bravo. I guess there's also- I'm, I'm, I'm pretty good at translating Minecraft James, to be fair. Yeah. Cause we, yeah. So I want to put that like there. All right, so where is the auto crafter? Uh, so the autocrafter is an interface into a molecular. Do we have that stuff though? Yep, it's in this chest, which is completely over the other side of the system. Um, okay, so right, so we need to set up. If you want to, did we have uh, inscriber? We didn't have inscriber automation yet, did we? Or set up yet? No, but I'd, I'd set up four inscribers ready to automate it. Right. Because I'd like to automate... I think we want to automate 4K. Right now. Okay. Which requires some stuff. Yeah, I'm going to need a couple of interfaces. And I mean, I'm just going to... Some... I'll just take all the stuff that's in here. Oh, look, I made advancements. Hey, Zeth Russ, thank you so much for 68 months. So... James, you're progressing. Yeah, I think... Um, let's set up um, some of that stuff down here. Uh, where, oh, right, okay, yep. So we're gonna need we're gonna need to really be doing uh, controllers now, because we we're gonna be out of channels quite quickly. Yeah. Um, in fact, it's probably worth. Have we got? We should have some wall and stuff, shouldn't we? Do you, let me just craft something that'll help understand this. We had a power already. We only have 25. No, no. There we go. What's taking up all the power? Probably just things in general. I mean, we don't have much stuff hooked up. No, power is fine. Like, this energizer just filled in a heartbeat, so... That's because I just swapped the batteries for a full one. Yeah. Oh. The miles and yeah, but we had those kind of cables before. So like right now it's going up. So that's good. It is yeah, so I mean yeah, we do need to probably figure out some other We also need to find a Why place for we... this crystal growth accelerator and stuff. Actually I'm gonna put some of the stuff. Why in. are we not uh... seeing half of our setup? I don't see all our storage. Like you're not seeing all the drawers? Yeah. Hmm. Like I have seen them. Like it was working. No, I'm just gonna just wanna check them. That device is online. Yeah, I see it right now. Like, I see everything right now. So it's all there. We don't have any space left on this drive, though. So you can you can see them all there. Yeah, I can see everything right now. Uh, 
if the other base is low power could that be could that connection be toggling based on low power well right now we have more than enough power and the only thing that's using that power right now is the me system like yeah nothing else is using this power it just this might just not be this might just not be enough so we're all are we all in the gigaloo at the minute uh surge is not where are you Surge, right now where is surge right now surge is making yeah. sand what do you need from surge Cause, yeah because x makes a point that it could be chunk loading oh maybe it was only working when i was standing because i've been flying back and forth to the old big lose and not yeah so it could load when i'm in this side of the base and when i'm not it doesn't oh fascinating uh all right i just need to go to the washroom for a second so i'm going to take a quick commercial break um by which i mean i'm gonna just watch uno here stay in this area uno cable and i'll be back in a sec okay didn't even leave with the carrot carrot milk song on i mean come on Give the people what they want, James. Carrot, carrot, milk, carrot, milk, carrot, milk. Sing it, Uno. Carrot, milk. 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 Carrot, carrot, milk. Carrot, milk. Carrot, milk. Carrot, carrot, milk. Carrot, milk. Carrot, milk. Yeah, there we go. Are you not entertained? Why? Why are you not entertained? We're trying so hard. Bring me the head of light entertainment. Where is James who needs to mute Uno and Surge? How dare you? <laughs> the very thought. I love how uh, some people just like are so used to typing the word Uno in all uppercase from yeah. from the game. Or just auto cracks, right? They're on mobile. Yeah, and your yeah, phone yeah. is like, clearly you meant... <laughs> clearly you meant the game. And not the Spanish word for one. Yeah, you see Contingent Cat saying entertained. Contingent Cat gets it. Yeah. I think we both really underestimated exactly how much glass this was going to take. <laughs> And actually something I'm kind of frustrated by, I just realized this, if you go to your stats and you go to your uh, block stuff, it appears that most of the modded crafting tables don't actually track your statistics. Oh yeah, yeah, so. Yeah, so if you're using a, what is it called? A builder's table as opposed to a crafting station instead of just a crafting table, it doesn't track. So I was like, I'm curious to see just how much blue glass I've made so far, because that would be a fun statistic. And nope, and it's, I it's don't just get like, to nope, the don't information, know. unfortunately. I, I like literally have never really used that menu. Sometimes it's neat. So in vanilla projects, um, I'm like, hey, I had to slab this huge radius around a, whatchamacallit, um, wither skeleton farm. How many slabs have I put down? I'm like, oh, cool, fifty thousand. Guess I'll cry. Like, <laughs> <laughs> well, that's several hours of my life I'll never get back. Yeah, but so it goes. So we literally got... just standing next to these furnaces, waiting for them to do stuff. So we've got five channels going here. One, two. One, two, three, four, four, and that is five. So it's not channels. It has to be chunk loading. Oh, so me standing here now, or I moved and it got worse? Is it a good thing or a bad thing? So if, if, you, if you come back to the gigaloo. Okay. If I do that, I'll stop making glass, but I'll do this for science. Hold on. 
All right, and then if it is chunk loading, we'll... I think it takes a couple of seconds to unload. Yeah. All right, did I break it? Uh, it's still loaded for the minute. Server view distance is like 10 chunks. Yeah, it's still loaded. It's still working anyway. Is it maybe when I've been just like ripping all the power out of the system when I charge my tool could, for half a second? Yeah, I mean, it could be, could be that as well. Hmm. I mean, clearly the option, the answer is just more solar panels. Just, ugh. Yeah. More power. I mean, there is a different kind of solar panel as well that I think is better. Sure. Uno, do you still need this Uno's Mine O'Clock stuff chest? No, nah, you can just throw it. It goes back some, in the day. It's got some good... It has a sponge in it. It's got a sponge in it. Oh, you have that. And a diamond chisel. And a trident, which we're not really using. I'll come and I'll come pick some of that stuff up. Move fast. I'm about to throw it directly into lava. No, my chest. Uh, that was rude. I apologize for that. Steel pickaxe. Yeah. You could smelt that down for steel. <laughs> yeah. Take the hammer. Uh, oh, the XP Matron. I forgot about that. Yeah, the rest of that stuff can get uh, get shut. So yeah, more solar panels. I think is the is the answer. That is the answer. And the yeah, I'm throwing literally just the entire chest and all of its contents into lava. Yeah, that's fine. It's actually very therapeutic. Oh, goodbye. I mean, I wasted some diamonds. I, I you know, I consumed an entire diamond chest carrier at the same time, but... You could have just made one like out of sticks. Was out of What's sticks. <laughs> Five sticks makes a chest carrier. That's yeah, well, I pulled the 60 <laughs> sticks out before I threw them into lava, so... Yeah. That's good, at least. So, it's, so you've still got the sticks. <laughs> yeah, I came uh, up net stick in that case. Yeah, well, that's... Some would say that's that's more important than a diamond. Probably. I'll just send these bags away. You know what I should do? I should have... Um, something auto-crafting fireworks to go into my ender pouch. All right. So that I always have fireworks on me. We're back. Hmm. Boop, boop, boop. Welcome back. I don't feel like... Ooh, fancy. <laughs> Smart cable. Uh, so... Just as a heads up, I have to turn off all of my audio for a second here because I'm running a farm that's very noisy. So please don't say anything important or funny for the next, I don't know, minute. Okay. So we are we're at three channels now. Yeah. Which says to me that... Yeah, Surge is miles away, so the big Lou is not chunk loaded. Right. Uh, so we probably want to move the storage into here as well at some point soon. I mean, the idea was create more and get out of the storage drawers. Like, we don't use them. Okay. Like, yeah, I, I think the idea is fill this thing up with drives and then just move everything into the ME system is what I want to do. Yeah, so uh, let's look at automating inscribers then, shall we? Do we need more power first or no? Oh, by the way, I'm back. Did I miss anything uh, hilarious? No. Pat, we don't need power. It's uh, 
we'll probably need to go and just get some stuff out of the storage. So you want to put it down here. So we have four inscribers. Yeah. And we do need access to some of the sides of them. Right. Uh, so calculation, engineering, logic. I need another inscriber. Do I only have four inscribers? Uh, yes. We only ever had four. Oh, we need a fifth then. Didn't you say we need uh, hugs, Broson? By the way, twenty-three months. Um, didn't you say we need access to the sides of these? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I'm remembering correctly from the olden days, the ideal setup for inscriber automation is five inscribers in a vertical stack. Uh, I mean, that, that, the, so the end one, you need access to the top bottom. You need access to four sides of it because you need to put something into the top of it, something into the bottom of it, something into the side of it, and then pull out the other side of it. Right. These ones, you need access to the two sides of them. So you could do these in a vertical stack. You could... So you could do this with these. Well, then could we replace... Could we put them up against these cables? Would that work? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, you could do that. So we do that. And then where does that last one need to go? Uh, it just needs to go somewhere. Uh, it will need power getting to it which you can feed in from the back. So we got another cable just to put into the back of that. Yeah. The combo we one would go on, have... go at the top. Yeah, wait, actually, is there a way to put this one, like, right here? Uh, you need, you need access to the bottom of it as well. We would, we just break that other piece of glass, right? I mean, it could go, it could go there. Yeah. Is that what you mean? Yeah. So, like, put it, yeah, right up top. Yeah, right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that can go there. Yeah, that'll look this will look pretty cool. Uh I'm just gonna we haven't got any ice around here have we? This is all just so we can actually see what's going on. Uh there's lots of ice up there, I know. There's an entire chest full or drawer full. No, that's he meant for melting purposes. Oh. Okay. Yeah, because we can't see. So, you can. what we can do is put interfaces on the left-hand side of each of these. And then um, import, import busters on the right-hand side. Right. Or we can try and save channels. And do it with do it with like a chest and then uh, 
Yeah, so I either we're gonna need to get some extra channels in here. Right. Or we have to do it with a chest and use a couple of mod uh, a couple of different linked mods to do it. Uh, I mean let's just I guess get more channels. Keep it clean. Yeah, so we need to we need a controller. Do we have a controller? No, we don't. Uh no. But you were looking at making one earlier. Yeah. So. so if I go here to make a controller. It's the ME controller. Yeah. Which we don't have a single thing for. So Sky Stone Block. Yeah, they're not difficult to make. And then we need an engineer press, comp uh, processor and pure fluid crystal. You can save a lot of so channels with loading. subnetting storage and export buses. Yeah. So I'm loading the storage for you at the minute as well. We have no... No coal. It's fun. I'm literally down in the mines grabbing coal right now because I realized we were out. We have some coal ore, which I'm just going to break up right now. But yeah. Oh, did we? I didn't know that. Cool. Oh, right. This has silk touch. That's probably why we have it. Yeah, it turns well, out... I've, um, got, I've got fortune on me, so I'll break this coal ore down. Yeah, when you're running... Uh, nine furnaces constantly to make glass. You uh, you go through coal a lot faster than you might be paying attention to. So that's entirely my bad. Um, so, Reverb, yeah, that is one thing that you can do. That's certainly what I do in my base, is, like, I was planning to put an export bus on for redstone and an export bus on for silicon with a crafting, uh, with a crafting uh, upgrade on it. Ooh, that looks good with the sun right there. Oh, we need... Oh, yeah, okay. Oh god, so much sand. Does the uh, thing in here still work? Well, like, you could do it all with XNet as well. You could feed in, just feed in the stuff to a chest and have, use XNet to pull things out. Why is that here? Mewie, 30 months, welcome back. All right, we got some sky stone blocks. There you go, coal is in the storage now. All right. I, I think I have enough for the second. Uh, so we go up here. Okay, this can go in here. Okay, so what do we need again? So we got those. Now we need pure flukes crystal and the engineering processor, which is printed Still engineering circuit and silicon. No, I don't think so. Not at least not anywhere in the storage system. Uh, so right. okay, so That's silicon diamond fluid beads and silicon. Diamonds, and we're gonna need a piece of redstone. So I should be able to take these down here. Inscriber. Oh, I can't. Okay, so this is inscriber. Silicon. There we go. Calculation. 
logic is in here. Yeah. Got that. We got that. And then this is a logic press. Nope, doesn't go in there. Calculation press. This is no. Oh, does it go in the top one again? Wait, what? It goes in here. Dur. It just goes into an inscriber. I know how this works. That's exactly what we're trying to build right now. I'm I'm good at this game. <laughs> All right. Uh, so now we just need some uh, pure flux crystal. I am crafting this over on my base. Okay. Because we need the we'd need to get the uh, crystal growth accelerator set up, and that takes power and time. Do we need more pure as well? Uh, we don't have any. I'll bring some pure over. Uh, Is how many... A... Sorry. How many pure fluids do you need? Four. What were you gonna say, Serge? Uh, how much more coal do we need, or have we kind of missed that? Because uh, I'm we're... just gonna grab a bunch while I'm down here. I mean, we have... 113 and 27 ore, 113 coal, 27 ore in the system right now. We could use I just more. I figure if I'm going to keep making glass, we're going to run into this problem more and more, right? Um, yeah, I mean, hopefully we can set up a better solution for glass than just burning coal, though, so. There's a lot of stuff going on in this space. So fancy. Maybe we should, we could put the, cause you can make like a bunch of controller blocks and kind of make them look super cool. Radius of the Gigaloo is 101. So this is ice, this is glass, right? Light blue panel. Do we have a lot more of this? Yeah, we've got it. That was me under the gateway for a minute. Out of blocks. I tried. All right, so is that pure in there now? Nice. Yoink. I said yoink. It won't let me take it out. There it goes. All right, so where does this go? Uh, where do we want it to go? Um, so each face will give you eight channels. Uh, we're going to want here one, two, three, four. We're going to want four on each side, which is eight. We're going to... We're going to want some dense cable coming out of this. Put, if you put it in the... If you replace the cable above the top inscriber... Like this one? Uh, I don't know which one you're pointing at. But, see, so you know the uh, two above that? Oh, two above that. Okay. Yeah, so the top the top inscriber. Uh, that's hard to get to. Uh 
and then I have an idea. Have we not got any more string? Uh, we should have some. Where the heck are all those cables going? Oh, there's one. Or is it is string stored in here? There's a string. Whoopsies. Da, da, da. Right. Did you manage to get the uh, thing in? Yep. So, yeah, as I say, you can get up to 32 channels coming out of the controller. Yeah. Uh, out of each face. But the problem is these small cables can only carry uh, eight channels. So you need dense cable, which is why I needed wall. I need more wool. <laughs> Man, if only someone hadn't taken down my string farm. I didn't take it down. It's not down. It's still there, my Excellent. dude. Excellent. Brilliant. No one took it down. <laughs> it should still be going. Is it not? Yeah, unless... unless The only thing that would have impacted it is your own power stuff. Yeah, I didn't take it down and it's still... Look at all this string. Excellent. I mean, sort of. Look at this. There's so much. It's not exactly expensive. It's just awkwardly so. Do you need me to get you a bunch of string here? Uh, I might be all right. I might be all right. Uh, I'll grab some. So let's put the... I like putting a smart cable in so I can see how many channels is being used. Huh. Alright. Uh, oh, I don't have room for the string in the freaking son of a... Yeah. Let's just go ahead and do this for a second. Yeah, I do actually need a few more pieces of string. Here. Okay. 
There we go. So that is... So that is 32 channels coming down here to these inscribers. One second. Nice. And then there'll be eight channels that go down towards the uh, storage buses. All right. So now we need how we need to make some importers. Uh, so we need importers and we need exporters. Interfaces. Do we need exporters or no? Uh, we'll want some exporters. As well. How many? Uh, we'll want. How many importers do we want? Uh, four importers. Okay, so we want four ME import bus. Uh, five. In fact, five. Make it five. Five M. Oh, shoot. Are we... We're not out of power. Okay, there we go. Oh, I'm not seeing... It's not chunk loaded again. Oh, there it goes. Okay. Okay, so what a coincidence! I just I just wound up back in there. So yeah. Okay, so import bus. We need a bunch of sticky pistons. One, two, three, four, five. Eh, of course, there's no. Uh, everything's so broken. Oh, we need a bunch of logic presses. Right. So we need gold, silicon, and okay. Uh, gold. I'll make I'll make some uh, logic circuit, printed logic circuits if you wanna cook up some silicon. Oh my god, I hate Electric Claire, thank you so much for that forty months, appreciate it. What do you have? What are you doing? Uh, I'm gonna make the gold part if you wanna cook up the silicon. I have some silicon here. Uh, so, I've made the silicon press, the bottom one. So there's that, and you've got the gold. So, what we're trying to do is automate this process. <laughs> so if you want to put, if you want to put the silicon in the top. Yeah. So it's X, it's the storage. The storage drawers are not chunk loaded. Yeah. Oh, it's just... so it's not the power, it's the it's, actual it's drawers. The... Yeah. That's the problem. Yeah. Oh. So the idea is oops. Alright, so we got that. Here's that. Um So the uh, what we're trying to do is get to a point where we can just um automate making 4K drives, and then we can just get rid of the storage drawers. This goes a lot quicker when there's two people doing it. Yeah. <laughs> I have three more printed silicon after this, but that's five. I think we just probably want to I mean, make we'll, them all. We'll get, we'll get through them, yeah. How much more silicon have you got? One more after this. That's my last piece. Okay, well that'll do for now. Yep. Okay, so that's gonna give me enough to go up back up here and make... So we want five import bus, right? Yeah, five import buses. So... Okay, so we wanna make... We need to make a bunch of these. Oh crap, we don't have any more slime. Oh yeah, we do. Never mind. Sorry, Uno, time for you to bleed again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, again. Wouldn't be the first time. Imports. Oh, right now. We need to actually make. Are uh, we out of power? Oh. No, still plenty in there. Uh we're not chunk loaded though, that's why. Again. Yeah, I'm in back in the gigaloo here. Do you want to fly over there, Funko? Or, yeah, not Funko. You're not Funko. 
Not even ah. close. Uh, okay. Port. Okay. Ah, uh, Druid tank class, two months. Hi, James. Hi, Serge. Hi, Uno. Hello. Hi, hi. I've made, I've made the mistake of calling Uno Funko before as well. That's not a new thing. So, I think one of the things we're, one of the ways we're going to be able to learn Uno how much we've used is we are completely out of ice so far we have 2740 ice back in that drawer which means the actual amount of glass we needed so far is over 3000 because i'm oh. i'm still not done one import bus two three four five okay so five import bus made what else do we need uh, we will need five interfaces. I think we have some. Yeah, so we could we could claim the chunks over here to keep them loaded. Uh, we'd probably need to claim the chunks like all the way. But it's not it's not like a problem because we'll just move all the all the storage eventually. Uh, we need fluix dust. Fluix dust. Yep. Uh, have we got fluix crystal? What do we have here? We have one interface here. We have pure sort of quartz here. Where do these imports go? So the imports are going to go on the right hand side of each of the interface, uh, each of the inscribers. And then we're going to need cables, I guess, to connect them actually up. Yep, I've just got some cables. All right. A little rain over there is looking pretty cool. And then we're going to need... Yeah, we need... Uh... Where do the interfaces go? I have one. Right, okay. So put the interface in your crafting table again. Yeah. So it's a flat interface. Yeah. And they will go on the left-hand side of these four. Oh, so we only need three more? Uh, we, we need one for the top, but we're not going to put that on the left-hand side. We need an export bus for the one on the top. Right. So we need four more interfaces and one export? Two export buses. Oh, we need two? Two export buses. Yeah. I don't think we're going to have anywhere near enough stuff for all of this. And offline. Power? Yep. I moved power slightly. Battery? Is it, yeah, is it the that battery? Is that the, like, is no, it power or is it that I'm not power. loading the storage? It's power. Okay. Uh, here, let me do this. There you go. Some more power in there now. Okay. So. Export. So we need two of these. How many? Sorry, two export buses. You said. Yeah, two export buses. Right. We still need a lot more fluids dust. Right. Let's go make some fluids dust. And do we have enough logic? We have four. That might be enough. Yeah, the America, we need access to like four sides, five sides if you include power. Hmm. 
So export is going to require two form. How many form? Okay, we have no formation core, right? No, we don't. So we need to make those two, and then interface requires. We need four more interfaces. So we need four. Uh, we're going to need five total. So yeah. yeah. And we need four. Okay, so we need. Okay. I'm just grabbing some Fluix dust. Uh, do you need anything else? Uh, no, I don't think so. What the heck is a player interface? Uh, the player interface uh, lets you access the player's inventory, if I remember rightly. Oh, that's neat. If it's the one I'm thinking of. something here folks one moment yeah so you can you can hopper um, into a player interface and it'll hopper into your inventory mm, neat hopping item interface okay um, I, do, I don't know why the stream would look no worse it shouldn't doesn't look worse to me all right, is the, uh, do you have flukes in here yet? Uh, I'm just coming down with it now. Okay. There you go. Okay. Flukes. So. It's just, uh, to your right. Oh. Okay, so... Export. Let's make these two export buses. So we need formation core, which is that. And then we need to do this, which is two. Wow, what? No. That's not at all how that works. Thanks, game. Export. Okay, one. To export. Okay. Interface requires. Okay, what do I have here? I have three annihilation core. I need two of these and then one of these. Perfect amount. Okay. One. Two, three, four. Craft these. Okay. Okay, so the rest of the. Does this go on the side? Uh, so this interface wants to go on the top of the top one. Top of the top of the top one. Okay. Yep. Some sword block. Okay, so there's that, and we need a cable up here, I guess. Yep, I have cables on me. And then where are these two export bottom? And so the two export bottom and left hand side. Yeah. And like switching out all of the ice for glass 
seemed like it wasn't going to be a big deal. <laughs> Boy, was that a mistake. <laughs> yeah. I don't quite like how that's connecting to the inscriber there. Uh... I mean, this looks cool as hell. Do this. I can eventually work on some kind of like interesting looking housing of it too. I could probably make it even bigger than it looks currently. There we go. That. Yeah, that looks good. Right. Okay. So we want the left, the left hand export bus wants to export. Um, redstone. How do you inter How do you actually see? So right click it. Oh, there it is. So we want to put red. So okay. So piece of redstone in there. All right. What what do I? I should probably just go grab a bunch of the items that we're going to need to add to these. Um. Yeah. So we just need redstone and we need printed silicon at the minute. Because we need to put these all on uh, thingies, all on crafting discs. Um, patterns, crafting patterns. Okay, well, we don't have any silicon, and I don't have access to um, the stuff right now. Okay, let me go and load it. We need more silicon as well. But no, I'm over here. I'm over here. Okay. The other thing we'll want to make is a crafting card. Okay. Um, are you there right now, Serge? Yeah, what's up? It's just not. We've got plenty of power. Yeah, it's not. It's just I'm not seeing the. Um... Oh, there it is. Okay, so I have a red piece of redstone. Yep. And we need a piece of printed silicon. And we don't have any silicon, so quartz. Uh, yeah, we, no, we some quartz. I can throw it in the room for us. Yeah, we need to crush some quartz and then smelt it. On it. Okay, so you can do that. So then I come over here again. So this can be redstone. Yep. And then what else? So what we're gonna do? So you want a printed, a printed uh, crafting card in okay, the cool. bottom export bus. Uh, so what, what will happen is basically the top interface, uh, the top inscriber will always have printed silicon and it will always have redstone in it. And then you interface the right uh, printed circuit that you want to make in the bottom, uh, in the top of it. Okay, so I can't make a crafting card right now. Okay, uh, so we want five patterns then. If you can make patterns. Uh, blank pattern. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Nope. Uh, did you make four of them? Because I think we've got a spare one. No. Yeah, we have a spare one. So if you can make four of them. Okay. Oh, it's quartz glass we ran out of. Uh, it's okay. Once we get this done, then then the automation is complete, right? And then we snowball out of control. I mean, it starts. It's it helps a lot, to be honest. Yeah, once getting this this section sort of automated is one of the big big parts of it. Oh, uh, we don't have enough power to make enough silicon because the furnace and the double crusher also require power. All right, well, thanks for tuning in today, everybody. Um, <laughs> that's going to be it for the show. I mean, I'm not actually joking. It is, we're like five minutes away from the end of the show, so. Um, I think uh, I'm going to make a tremendous effort to actually um, hop on at some point over the next week 
and try to get some stuff going. Uh, just in an effort to make sure the next episode... Because I want to keep going with the auto-crafting and getting the ME system set up, so I think I'll, I'll spend some time in the next week um, trying to make that happen. And I just need another 10 stacks of glass and I can actually finish off the inside. It'll feel good. Only 10 stacks. Yeah, current glass count is almost 3,500. Luna, remember when you're like, oh, three or four stacks, that ought to do it. Yeah, 40 stacks, you know, whatever. I think I'm over 40 stacks. I mean, what's Oh yeah, that's why. Oh my God. We never connected what? these. That's freaking... Oh, does it, are not all of your solar panels connected oh, to... Oh, they're not all lasered together. They're not all lasered together. Thing. Oh, so only one quadrant of all of that was working? Yep. I wonder how I had to keep swapping batteries out. <laughs> there we go. Wait, oh, that didn't work. Oh, why didn't that work? Yeah, honestly, 95% of my modded life is getting AE2 working, interfacing machines into my AE2 network, and making farms to autogen stuff to AE2. Yeah. Nice. Okay, that hopefully the messages do not help me in any way. By the way, <laughs> those messages are Something useless. It's like this doesn't work. Here's <laughs> four reasons why it might not work. This doesn't work for any myriad of reasons. It is the yeah. worst error message in the world. All right, so is that actually working? Uh, should be working. Uh, let's have a look. Okay, well, power is going down right now, but. Um, question about batteries. Do you think because we have such an influx of power during the day and we lose all power at night? Oh, right. It's nighttime. Can you do sleep? You think, do you think batteries would be able to offset that? I mean, ideally, yes. We have the biggest battery in there. Could, could we use multiple? All right. So this is going up. Uh, yeah, you can use you can use multiple. You just pull battery boxes. All right, so this definitely seems to be going up faster than it was, right? So question A2 versus refined storage. I think largely A2, but refined storage actually works with fluid. A2 does not like fluids very much. Yeah, this is going up. Yeah, it's going up. Yeah. Yeah, I think that helped. It should theoretically like be four times faster now. Yeah. <laughs> God, I like this door. This door's good. It's a good door. I it sounds these. really good. I love the concrete doors. Yeah. Uh, all right. So I wasn't joking. It is actually one o'clock, so it's the end of the show. Um, thanks, everybody, for hanging out today. Thanks to Uno and Serge, as always. Uh, I will talk to you gentlemen uh, next week. Thank same time friends. i'm same really channel. happy with what we got done today like really 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 happy yeah i'm excited i think next together. week we'll continue to work on me continue to move everything over to the gigaloo um and yeah i think it's going to be fun uh all right so i'm going to disconnect from discord so goodbye Bye. Bye. and we are going to end off the stream listening to m drift's great song one more time because why wouldn't we uh, so thanks everybody for hanging out coming up next in about a half an hour is talking sim with uh, Corey and Cameron and they're gonna keep playing disco uh, Elysium at least I think that's what they're doing and Then later is a bonus episode with Adam in Adam's game house where I think he's gonna actually finish finish persona 5 today So you're looking forward to that Thanks everybody for hanging out. This was a lot of fun. Uh, I will see you all uh, later. Uh, pause. Play. Bye! This is the recipe for the perfect night vision coffee.
you weren't around last week, I said carrot and milk a whole lot. Carrot, carrot, milk, carrot, milk, carrot, milk. 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 Carrot, 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 Carrot milk. Carrot milk.